Monday, we are off to Ikea uh, to buy some baby stuff. We need a bath mat, we need some shelves. So we're all bundled up, it's a little bit misty and ready to go. I'm really tired, the clocks went back, uh, which is great for people who can then just have an extra hour in bed. Not great for people who've got babies who have learned to wake up at the same time every morning like clockwork and now instead of half past seven waking up they're getting up at half past six yay i'm in shelf nightmare why did we come here can't decide what we want it's hideous oh you wave hi everyone it's tuesday we got back from ikea in one piece yesterday and we're still married, which is good. That's Mr. Amar and I, not me and the baby, obviously. Uh, today, I'm going to Knightsbridge. Would it be classed as Knightsbridge? That sort of area. Um, I've won a really amazing award. It's the Cosmetic Executive Women's uh, Achiever of the Year Award. So I'm really proud and really sort of I feel really jittery about it because uh, it's quite a big thing. So I've started to do my makeup but we're going to drive in. Mr AMR is coming as my guest um, and we have a lovely table full of my friends and people that I work with and it's going to be a really nice evening. Uh, I'm going to do the rest of my makeup in the car and I've got my dress to wear and stuff. Hair, I don't really trust myself to do it myself. Um, I'm not feeling amazing today actually and I, as I said I feel a bit sort of jittery and nervous um, so I'm going to go and get it done. I'm going to Hershison's in Harvey Nichols and I've got to be there at four so I'm just collecting a few of my things together. I've just been shooting um, the before and afters for my next foundation review which is going to be the Clinique Beyond Perfecting which isn't a new foundation but it's brilliant uh, and that's what I'm wearing now. So I've been doing the before and afters for that, which I shouldn't be really because I should just be getting ready to go. Uh, and now I'm throwing everything into a bag. Oh, eyelash curlers. And I'm going to get a move on, otherwise I really will be late. I'm in person having my blow dry. This is Rich. Say hello, Rich. Hello. <laughs> We're doing... Sort of bit of volume and movement, wave. We've got to stay in all night, so working very hard to make sure that it doesn't drop out. Aren't you rich? Yes, we do. <laughs> That's where I have to do my speech later. I'm in the Jumurai Hotel, which is where the CW Awards are happening. We're doing a little sort of run through rehearsal. I've got my speech here, all typed out. And um, yeah, I'm wearing my lacy dress from Tiffany Rose and my clunky. Um, one day I'll learn how to use this bloody camera. My clunky top shop shoes because I can't walk in anything else. And I'm just about to do my eye makeup in this weird pink lighting. So that's a bit fun. And then I'm going to go meet Mr. AMR because he's outside somewhere waiting for me. Smart now, Dom. So, thanks for that. Maggie Atwell, General Manager, Parfum Christian Dior. <laughs> I've done my speech, so now I'm feeling very relaxed. And look how posh our table is. We've each got a little Chanel gift on our placemat, and also. As part of my prize, I have got something else in here. 
I don't know what's in there yet, I'll open it tomorrow. Look what's in the bags! Nice! <laughs> Save mine for tomorrow. And these, look at these goodie bags, these are like the poshest goodie bags in the world. Pouch that you could use as a clutch, should you want to. And it's filled full of lovely Oh my god, I love by Terry. Lovely beauty things. Including Ta-da ta-da! Best dry shampoo in the world. Here I am in the um, program. Is it a program? What would you call it? Hello, Mr. Bear. Oh, baby Angelica. Just got home. You know when you leave in a hurry and then you get back and it's really late and then you really regret not having tidied everything up. <laughs> That's how I feel. I'm really tired. It's quarter to one. Um, I just drove back and it took about an hour and a half because the motorway was closed. So yeah, feeling really tired. I've loved wearing this dress today. This is from Tiffany Rose. It felt very Dolce & Gabbana. Uh, and I'm gonna do a maternity sort of evening wear lookbook. So I'll make sure this goes in because it's a really good one. If anybody's pregnant and thinking they need a dress for Christmas or something, it just looks really sort of smart and I don't know, I really like it. It hugs in all the right places. So that's me, I'm turning in for the night. I've got loads of lovely messages and Instagram comments and stuff about my award. So um, I'm gonna read those in the morning. But yeah, the baby's gonna be up in sort of six and a bit hours. So I better get some sleep because this baby is going crazy. Uh, mainly because I had a full fat Coke to try and keep me awake through the dinner. So yeah, it's dancing around. Let's hope I get some sleep. Wednesday, nanny day, uh, so I'm in my office <clears throat> and I've got so much stuff to do and so much stuff to sort. There's just stuff everywhere. I'm going to film a quick video um, because I want to go through some of the Christmas makeup that's come out and it's all beautiful and so I thought it'd be quite nice just to do a little video on that. I don't know when it will go up but... Um, I've got to film my overnight mask video that I've been meaning to do for ages because I've been excited about that. And before I do that, I've got to do makeup anyway. So quite often what I do is I film another video beforehand of makeup. Yes, so hopefully in the next hour, I will do two videos. I've prepped them. I'm pretty tired, as you can probably tell from my eyes. Um, because I got in really late last night and I've had a little nap and now it's three o'clock, the day's just gone. I've been doing other stuff, work stuff, but the day's just gone. Um, the sun is already really low and I reckon I've not got that much time. So that's what I'm up to, just in case you were wondering. Look, this looks really good. Um, it's a new treatment from Redkin. Is it Redkin? Yeah and it's called Heat Cure, and it's like a self-heating mask. I'm gonna try this tonight, I'm quite excited about that. Thursday, we're off to Westfield. This vlog makes it look like we spend our time, when I'm not working, just going to various shopping centres. Um, it's not true, it's just that I have loads and loads of baby stuff that needs returning, and it's got to be done by a certain time. And um, why else are we going to Westfield? Oh, I've got a 40% code for Gap. I don't know. I, I don't know whether I've gone on about Gap loads this vlog. I swear that I don't have shares in them or anything like that. It's just that every time I go online, 
they have some kind of discount code. It's ridiculous. And today's one is 40%. Mr. AMR loves a Gap Basic. A Gap shirt, Gap t-shirt. <laughs> He's pulling the worst face. He hates me talking about him. Only because people like, he loves a basic. Um, so, yes, that that has sort of swayed the day. Also, I need to go to Superdrug because I'm doing my next 10 under 10 uh, thing and I think I'm going to do it on liquid lipsticks. So I just need to have a little root or tootle about in there. Oh no, my battery's running out. Oh no, I didn't bring my handbag with my spare battery. Right, I'm going to go in case anything exciting happens and I need to turn it back on again. for the most useless vlogger goes to me because camera ran out and who has taken no footage the whole time she's been here meeting Mr AMR in John Lewis. he's gone to the lighting department thrilling life of Ruth Crilly. can't get anything done today. I had a really long sleep but I just feel so tired all the time and then I remember I've got this huge baby growing on the front of me. Because I'm so used to, I just love getting work done. <laughs> I find it really difficult that I physically can't do it. So the baby's having a nap. I'm going to have a nap. Um, and then maybe I'll try and get something done after that. I've got proper Friday vibes going on when you're just like, oh, I can't be bothered to do anything. But I have to. Because I'm away this weekend, so I can't get any work done tomorrow. So it's got to be done today. And it gets dark at four o'clock. Which means that it needs to be done sort of oh, crinkly floor, forehead. Um, forehead needs oiling. It's really dry. And do you know why that is? Because I washed my face this morning and then I forgot to do the rest of my routine. Where am I looking? Have I been looking there the whole time? Sorry, you're over there. <laughs> why does one of my eyes look weird and the other one doesn't? Odd, isn't it? Look, that looks really red and that one doesn't. Something monumental has just happened. The baby has today started walking, properly walking though. She's been almost walking for months and months and months and months. But she has let go and now she just sets off. Sorry, my eye is really distracting me. Um, obviously this isn't as important as the baby walking, but what is going on? Anyway, it's amazing. She just sort of sets off and she even stops pick stuff up so really happy uh, and now we're going to go and sort out her room because we bought her some ikea shelves mr amr has built those today built them put them together um but we just need to sort of work out where they're going to go and it's got dark outside so i can't do my videos so i thought i'll just use the time in a productive way oh, I was going to cave in and have Domino's tonight because Mr AMR is going out and he'll probably be out till about midnight and I can never be bothered to cook for myself, not at the moment anyway. However, I found uh, an aubergine that needed using up because we're away this weekend and so I have made um, a sort of Italian Sicilian aubergine thing, I can't remember what it's called now. It's like garlic, chilli, cubes of aubergine, tomatoes. Um, I might watch Fifty Shades of Grey because I've just finished all of the four. I don't know whether you've seen that with Gillian Anderson and Jamie Dornan's in that. And so I now want to watch Fifty Shades of Grey, not for the sexy parts, but just because I can't believe that he's like this psychotic killer in the fall and then he's gonna be this sort of charming, 
sex god. We'll see. Dexter! Just a bit here. Searching for the white chocolate magnum, this bag of frozen vegetable things sort of burst and they've all gone into the drawer. And I kind of feel like it's a sign from above not to eat the magnum. But on the other hand, I don't care. And I know, look, I can only find double chocolate ones. They're all minis, by the way. So, you know, they're allowed. Right, it's gonna have to be a double chocolate magnum with caramel. And get back in there, vegetables. Don't want to look at your face. Make me feel bad about myself. I've got my magnum. I'm going to eat it um, with a towel wrapped around me because I've got my good linen on the bed. And as we all know, magnums drop chocolate everywhere. Oh, I don't know about Jamie Dornan without a beard. What do you think, Dexter? It's better as a serial killer. Oh goodness, it's just as bad as the book. I just paid six ninety nine for this. Oscar winning lines there from Dornan. You can tell how riveted I am. I'm actually on the internet looking at beauty products and they're in the red room of pain. Uh, I'm going to leave this vlog now because I'm going away tomorrow. Oh, hold on, let me just pause. Oh, actually, it's a boring bit. Um, I'm going away tomorrow and then it'll be Sunday and I won't have time to edit it. I was going to get a really hot mug of tea, hold it just underneath where the camera is and make my glasses steam up and sort of edit in some rude sounds from the television. But I just don't have the energy. Sorry. Look, one eye still looks really funny. Is that just the light? Oh yeah, it's just the light. Okay, bye.